I'm an Aki Osho. Gay news finished. Real programming starts now. Kisses. Go! Kyle and Jackie Osho. Kisses. Kevin Hart, Tiffany Haddish are on air with us. Good morning. Hey. Good morning. We ready. Look how you doing? You guys look, uh, well, I Fresh. know you're movie stars and stuff like that, but like superbly presented. Love mm, it, man. Thank you. We're trying to represent. Mm. Well, yeah. I always like coming here. The compliments always come in yeah. on, a, on a very high level when you That's come right. to the station. <laughs> That's right. Very, very nice and always appreciated. Oh, well, Got, oh, I said a pube on your mic. What I don't was know, that? But if it was, I didn't put it here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You're pube free. Eh? I'm just assuming. Well groomed yeah, man. I am a well groomed man. Yeah. How groomed are you though? Like well what are we groomed. Talking? As well, as as perfect as groomed can be. That's really? What I am. Yes. Mm. yes. Wow. I'm I'm very high when it comes to the. Uh, Tiffany's the shaking her head. She doesn't like that. Well groomed. You don't like that. I like my men a little scraggly. Yeah. Okay. That's why I like it here in Australia. You do like it. Yes, because there's some big hairy men here. Yeah, I like them hairy, like little bears. You know. Yeah. Just pick me up and burp me, sir. Okay. Right. That's, that's Bring on the hairy rugby players with missing front teeth. I like it. This is just disgusting. Yeah. I apologize. Kevin, that's not your flow. Do you want a big hairy woman with missing front teeth? Is Absolutely not. <laughs> Absolutely not. I don't I don't deal with the hair. That's not that's not my thing mm. at all. You know, uh, what I do love is, uh, you know, my wife. Yeah. Uh, let's <laughs> right. oh, there we go. I've been in enough trouble, so let's go ahead and cut that off right there. Let's cut the head off. Does your wife travel with you, or does she uh, does She have her own thing going? What's happened? Where is she? Is she uh, with you? My wife is home. My wife is home with the uh, with the kids, yeah. with the family. So, no, she doesn't uh, travel with That's me. That's good, though, because you imagine dragging the whole family all over the world. It, it depends on where I am. If I'm shooting a movie, I don't I don't mind. If, yeah. I'm, if I'm filming... Uh, um, you know, and I'm, I'm in a location for a month, two months, and it's in the off time where my kids don't have school, yeah. etc. Then I'm okay with that. If right. it's if it's something where it's during the school year, then I pop in and out. I just kill right. myself with travel. That's so. right. Yeah. Yeah. Tiffany, you're active. different. You wouldn't. You don't want to work on a film all day and give your whole heart and soul to your craft to go home and have to put up with kids and taking out the trash and doing all the duties that a spouse has to. Well, do. I take out the trash and all that stuff. My Myself, because mm. I live by myself Do with you? my animals. How That's, many animals? And my and my grandma stay there, and my brother stay there. Let's be honest, they living off of me right now. Okay, well, <laughs> Tiffany, <laughs> you must be tell these nice people in Australia that Tiffany. They but you know, I that. just want. I'm sure I'm not the only person who worked their ass off and their family member live off of. Okay, well that's just well, <laughs> Tiffany. I want you to take the aggression out your voice. Hey, right Tiffany, now. I'm sorry, I love my family. <laughs> Weren't you in the beginning? Didn't Kevin give you three hundred bucks to help you survive? What? Yes. He, well, yes. 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 I I don't think it was necessarily to help me survive. It was more so to get me out of his face. No, no. It was to help <laughs> you survive. I gave you yeah. money to save your life it's at not, the time. It's we, not no, a lot you, of money, though. You gave it? me what money. You, you said get, my, get yourself a place to stay for a week, which I don't know where in Los Angeles <laughs> you can stay all, for a week for $300. Hours. Hours. Well, Skid Rose. What well, we're like doing like is skipping past the intent. It's not about the amount of money. It's the intent. Yeah, the intention. And what I meant the money to do and be. At the time, it was, yeah. it was a for great us, thing. that's a lot of money. I was like, she can get a lot of a lot of number ones, number twos, <laughs> number threes at at any fast food place. If she's, at, <laughs> if, she's if she's in a need for food or whatever, I I'm was doing very my job. Then. I'm doing my job. I'm yeah. helping. Yeah. How long have skinny. you two known each other for? Since 2005. Wow. Known each other for a very long time. That's yeah. a long time. Very, very long time. Yeah, I like that. And when that. you work on a film like this, The Secret Life of Pets, it's animated, you wouldn't even be working together, would you? Nah, nah, we no. didn't even see each other. Yeah, you're, so you're that was a requirement, wasn't it? Not to see each other. Yeah. Well, it's, in, it's, in, it's <laughs> no. in my it's in my contract, not hers. Uh, uh, no, but it's uh. It costs you, you three hundred every time you see us. Huh? <laughs> well, no, that is not true. It costs me three hundred every time I see him. Uh, you you shut your mouth, Tiffany. Bed. You shut your mouth, Tiffany. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes. Uh, no, this but, movie will be good. I can tell just by the energy of this. Too. <laughs> the beauty, the beauty of the way that we do these. You know, we're in the booth by ourselves for quite some time. Yeah. And as you're doing the movie, you know, you can only think and and have an idea of what your co stars are doing so right. when you get to see these pieces come together and they're cut up it's so dope because everybody's energy it 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 flows you right. know yeah. and because we give so many different levels when we're in the mm -hmm. booth and I think that's a that's a, a major compliment to all actors and actresses that are in this movie you know we do so many different takes in so many different ways so they by, can marry it up yeah, with the other one they can marry it in, in the wouldn't synergy. it be easy just to get everyone together yes. so you know what the other one's saying I'm gonna be honest with you I don't like to be around people right. so, so <laughs> 
I mean, I, I, I like it by myself. You know, I go into a candlelit booth, uh, very soft music. Yeah. Uh, I don't wear pants. Is that's the a, rock laying a, in that booth? It sounds like the rock's laying in that No, booth. he's not laying in that booth, and if he was, I'd whip his ass. So he's not in there. <laughs> he, with this, that feud still continues. It's always going to continue. Mm. It's, yeah. a, it's an ongoing feud. He uses his size against you, too. I find that. Why you use that intimidation? I don't know why people keep saying this size thing. Me, we are the same size. <laughs> if, you, if you look at us, yeah. it just depends on the angle. It's yeah. all on yeah. the angle yeah. that yeah. you look at yeah. us from. Yeah. We're the same that. size. I don't know why people keep going, why is he so much bigger? I don't see it. I don't I don't well, see it. Obviously, Kevin has some eye problems. Yeah, I, don't, I don't see it, man. You know, Tiffany, before we went on air, you were on your phone just a second ago, and I was so confused about what was going on. It looked like you had a camera set up at your house. Oh, yeah, I have ver- various cameras set up all in and throughout my house mm-hmm. and on the outside of my house, and the mailman had came, and he was trying to leave something. He was ringing the doorbell. He was trying to leave me a package, so I was telling the mailman, just go ahead and put it on the side of the house. And then yeah. I hit my brother up and told him, go get that package since you live in rent free you can get the mail at least all right, all right. so you have like your phone has access to a microphone at the front yeah, of your house yeah. where you can oh yeah yeah i could people. cuss people out like get off my porch right now what the hell are you doing like, yeah. that's why i don't go to tiffany house yeah, yeah. i don't go to tiffany yeah. house. i don't trust i'll be like no leprechauns allowed and then <laughs> kevin walks away all sad <laughs> why did you Sorry. laugh like that why did you just laugh like that that was the biggest laugh that you gave since we've been here because the minute she, she gets the she man calling funny. me jackie i she can't believe you just I can't believe you just laugh like that in my face like that. <laughs> you think I'm a leprechaun? <laughs> I mean, you do got a lot of money. Oh, my God. You got that pot of gold somewhere. <laughs> oh, know. my God. Let's play a song. More coming up with Kevin Hart and Tiffany Haddish this morning. Kyle and Jackie Owen kiss. Kiss. Sydney's number one breakfast show. Okay, there, here they are. Kevin Hart, Tiffany Haddish. They're in here celebrating the secret life of Pets 2 in cinemas. June 20, a big premiere tonight. It's a celebration. It is. Yes. Everyone's going to show up. The carpet will be there. Yeah. Is it in, it's, it's, it's part of your life, though. The photographers, the red carpets, all this stuff. Is that a fun part of it? I like taking pictures. I think I look good in You them. do look good in are them. You you, gonna, you th- boy, you better stop. I mean, baby mama's you got. <laughs> oh, no. Are you going to smuggle chicken in your purse again? Girl, no, I actually am getting an emotional support chicken. I'm going to put it on the leash and let them know I walk my food before I eat it, okay? Because you are what you eat. Uh, Hello. There you go. I think this premiere actually going to have food. So, oh, yeah, I don't know if you've good. ever been to the Met Gala, but it don't, they don't really they have They don't have they, food they don't, there? I mean, they got food, but it's not really that much. They give you like two ounces of oh, carrots. Really? I've never been. You know You've never been to the Met Gala? I've never been to the Met Gala. <laughs> then, you know, they only invite fashionable people. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hold on. I ain't never say, I ain't never been invited. I've been invited several times you just, just haven't gone I've never went too busy mm. no you know what it is it's just I don't I'm I don't want to go there and get caught in those fashion conversations that I really don't want to be a part of. Well, well, men, we don't know a lot about fashion conversations. Like, no, listen, I love fashion. I'm just talking about the the conversation. Yeah, you know, it's the, not a lot of fashion conversation. It's more so like business conversation. Wearing? Oh, is it? Like, oh, yeah. What's that you that know? you're wearing? Yeah. I, I don't know, brother. Yeah. <laughs> no, they usually they're usually <laughs> like, you look amazing. Hey, I'm working on this project. I'd love for you to work with me. Like me and Beth Midler, we're gonna start gardening together. <laughs> we're is that doing a du Is that a du blah? Du blah? <laughs> I'm sorry, what? What's that? that? Are you wearing a duet blade Uh, Uh, duet? Now, this is just a jacket. Yeah, Yeah, no, I don't know, man. It's just a black jacket. (laughs) So I told me to put it on. I just put it on with the duet. Don't don't you get envious, though, when you see all the the Kendall Jenners and all the uh, Miley Cyruses in the photo room, in the bathroom? All no. taking selfies? You don't no, want to they be hungry. No, <laughs> they are hungry. I'm telling you. Every you'd be surprised who came up to me asking me for a piece of chicken. Is that right? When it was it was a lot of white people. A lot of white people. Please give <laughs> us chicken. They wanted the chicken. They very, was hungry. These are very bold people because who knows where Tiffany pulled this chicken out from? Yeah. So anybody that <laughs> they hungry. Um, I don't and that know chicken what, was delicious. Like I'm willing to bet it was like in a napkin. It was like something. No, like, it was uh, in a sandwich bag. Oh my god! It was in a Tiffany. sandwich bag with a couple of holes poked in it so the chicken. Could breathe. Oh. <laughs> Do you have any so- dipping sauces? No, I didn't bring any dipping sauces. They didn't need it. It was seasoned to perfection. No, no. I know how to cook. Don't nobody I want bet that, you did. Mm, that sweaty chicken well. that came out of Tiffany bag. I don't want that chicken. Yeah, Tiffany. whatever, Kevin. You would have been tearing that chicken up. You'd be like, this shit is delicious. I damn sure would have. I probably would have told Tiffany, stop me a piece of that chicken real quick. <laughs> you guys, um, <laughs> are you going to go to any restaurants while we're here? Because we had a chef in earlier and he just went to a restaurant here where they sell um, fish sperm deep fried. I'm sorry, what? what? Mm, fish sperm. So 
fish sperm deep fried. Apparently amazing. I'm me not, no, I barely <laughs> eat people's sperm. You lost me at sperm. I think I... I, I, I got an issue with people's sperm. I'm definitely not going to be eating no fish sperm. Yeah, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I, I got to love you. I got to have an opportunity to love this fish <laughs> before I, I start eating this sperm. I don't know why she made eye contact with me when she delivered the message. <laughs> <laughs> I got fish sperm out here, Kevin. What the hell are you telling me that for? What I don't even eat the eggs. What what is, that, is that the sperm right there? It's the sperm. That yeah, looks yeah. disgusting. Yeah. <laughs> what about my body posture just now? That made looks like, like a kidney. I need to know about the fish sperm. <laughs> yeah. oh, mm, that's oh, not God. cute. What, are people, what is wrong with people? Why, why, why is this fish sperm so why big? Fish sperm? Mm. You can either eat it or you can spit it out, as I suggested. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Mm. That's I wouldn't much. swallow. <laughs> okay, guys. This is just. I'd rather just spread that around on my skin. Put okay. that on my face. Oh, my God. This, this is, is why my skin is radiant now. Okay. I can't be a have, part of this. Have you guys heard of the caviar facial? Caviar, fish eggs, facial. Have you ever had that? Mm, mm, mm. You don't want that? Mm, mm. I ain't talking it's about no thing. facials on this show, man. <laughs> All right? Ain't nobody giving me no facial. <laughs> and damn sure ain't going to be no fish. It ain't going to be nobody else. <laughs> so let's make that perfectly clear right Just now. Just your wife, right? Huh? Yeah, I mean, no, I know. My wife ain't even giving me a face. <laughs> that means something going on that I need to know about that, that I haven't been made aware of. <laughs> we have um, interviewed some children, told them that you two oh, are good coming segue. In. Let's go oh, from the no. facials and sperm <laughs> and fish to kids. This well, is a great Yeah, but that's job, how you guess. get kids. Go ahead. That's right. Go ahead. <laughs> Not through if, the skin, if, if, if you don't, if you don't. Yeah, man, you, uh, Kev, if you, you don't to get uh, some swallow the fish sperm. Kev, you, Kev, you try to get some sperm on your face. Well, before you answer that, let's go to these kids real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Xander, a little child has got some questions because these are the kids that are wanting to see this movie, but everyone can see the movies for the whole family. Okay, right. so Xander's five years old. I think her question's for you, Kevin. Okay. Okay. Hi, my name is Xander and I'm five years old. Kevin, do you get teased for, for being short like I do? Oh, isn't that cute? You know what, man? Uh... I've never been teased for being short. I've only been uh, embraced and, yeah. and loved mm. because of my height. So what mm. I need you to do is understand that being short just means that you got superpower, buddy. That's okay? true. It's true. Everybody, it's easy to be tall. Yeah. You know how hard it is to be short? It's very hard. So anybody that's teasing you is simply jealous because they don't have the opportunities of fashion that you have. <laughs> Their clothes look stupid and yours never will. <laughs> All right? Okay, buddy? All right. I love what a it. great answer. Yeah. Okay, we who's got next? Bo, who's 10 years old. I think this one's for you, Tiffany. Hi, I'm Bo. I'm 10 years old. Tiffany, who's the hunkiest boy you've ever worked with? Oh, good Thank question. You. And that look, he, she's getting a lot of attention now from Thank Kevin. You, Kevin's you rubbing it. First off, Kevin, get you your hand off my back. Well, you don't have to say it. I they didn't ask me who the littlest boy is. <laughs> I was like, we said the hunkiest. You just heard me give that boy advice, okay? Now, just no, wait. Be, be careful, okay? The hunkiest guy I ever worked with. Mm. Mm. I've worked with a few. I'm a well, of course. <laughs> like Kofi, I would go with Kofi, but you know I'm getting ready to do a movie with Chris Hemsworth, and so oh. all that's about to change. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that, that's good. We had yeah. Chris on three days ago. Mm. Yeah. I'm gonna be on. I mean, I'm this, gonna be working with him yeah, in everybody, January. Does everybody slow down and let her finish the list? Go ahead, Tiffany. Finish. Finish the, the list. No, they else. asked the hunkiest. I know, but like, I'm saying that, at, that's you were, one. Well, you were at two, so keep continuing. You want me to continue? Yeah, because you with uh, the more even more attractive men that I've worked yeah, with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go with the more yes, attractive. Say, Are you be, sure? It's got to be more. Are you sure? <laughs> yes, it's got to be. Because you know, uh, I, I've done a couple of things. I have worked with uh, 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 Michael B. Jordan in a little something. Yeah, I know, you know, right. uh, definitely. Yeah, he's very handsome. Yeah, yeah, he's very handsome. Keep it going. Let's keep it going. Oh, you want me to keep going? Yeah. Oh, you know, I got a movie coming. Out called the kitchen and Commons in that he's he's kind of attractive yeah, you know right. a lot of women yeah, like him that's right uh, and uh, just before you finish let me set this up for mm -hmm. people uh, I definitely don't claim to be the <laughs> the finest man in the world but obviously Tiffany sees it that way yeah, so go ahead and tell well, me I who's find, number one I find to, you yeah tell to me be who's, the hmm? uh, the uh, <laughs> The cu on, you're cute. Come on. Oh, he's so cute. Why do that to a man? Because he's married. I don't have no. I don't. Once you. Once I know you married, yeah, you, yeah. you don't. You're blank. Yeah, you're yeah. blank. You're a blank face <laughs> to me. <laughs> like I'm not attracted <laughs> any, anymore. Well, first of all, I like that. I mean, you know. Mean. I think who's the blankest faced man you know? The blankest. The face? blankest face man. 
the Kevin. blanket. Kevin. Yeah, that's the blanket. blanket. I can't see. I barely see his eyeballs. Oh Jesus Christ! Now wait yeah. a minute. Is this about my skin color? Is this no, about no. This is happening? about this is about the blankness of you. You married, bro? Oh, okay, I'm you're out. That. All you right. finished? Yeah, you out. I, I mean, fine. Chris Hemsworth. I know he's married, but I oh, still no, can see. Right. You can still kind of see, but not all the way. But I can still kind of see. If you squint your eyes, a little blurry, but I see. Okay, next one is a four-year-old named Artie. Hi, my name is Artie, and I'm four, and I like lollies, and my mummy loves doing yoga in bed with daddy. Do you what? like doing yoga in bed? Oh, uh, shit. Oh, mommy oh my like God. My mommy and daddy <laughs> like doing yoga in bed. Oh, no, you know, I haven't had yoga in bed in a while. That's why I'm here. <laughs> Looking for some uh, available uh, yoga instructors, uh, preferably male. Uh, well, the first and thing, strong. Uh, that like to burp. I think we're skipping the, 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 major, the major point here. These kids need to drink some tea over here in Australia. They got some very deep voices. <laughs> that little boy sound exactly the same. <laughs> <laughs> those, are, those are matching voices Bulgy, just now. Yeah, kids. <laughs> do you like to do uh, yoga in bed? My mom daddy do yoga in bed. <laughs> <laughs> do you do yoga in bed? Hey, how old is that kid? Is that four. Four. Are you sure four. that that's a four-year-old? Yeah. Yeah. That's right. a four-year-old Australian kid. Okay, all right. <laughs> okay, next one. Who's next? Okay, Sophia, who's four years old again. Hi, my name's Sophia, and I'm four years old. I have a question for Kevin. Why is swearing bad? What? Why? Why, why is swearing bad? Why is swearing oh, why bad? Why is swearing bad? Why is swearing bad? Well, uh, sweetie, I think it all depends on who you ask. Um, you know, there's ways to swear. I am a, um, I am what you call a very uh, innocent swearer. Innocent. So, so the words mm. may be swear words, mm -hmm. but my approach and delivery on giving those words comes off innocent. Oh, oh what a beautiful you give us way an to example. Yeah, come on, man. What the? What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> see, that? see, see, it's 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 yes, yes, it's playful. Yeah, it's, it's playful. Like, but you, you don't feel you don't feel threatened by that. No, no, you. Don't. Oh no, I'm not. Well, not with me. I'm I, if I'm swearing, I'm I'm swearing. No, yeah, 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 yeah. I'll be like these crazy bitches don't know who the fuck see, they see, fucking with. See, see, that's aggressive. That's that's aggressive. They don't know what the fuck they done got themselves into. I will. All right, let's yeah. just relax, <laughs> Tiffany. That's see, and it's and it's bad because some people are afraid of that. <laughs> well, and, and, and I hope that answers that four-year-old girl's question. But you should do it when you're doing yoga. <laughs> that's what you're supposed to do. Yeah, swear. that's what you say the best. <laughs> okay, guys. Next one is Colby, seven years old. Hi, my name's Colby. I'm seven years old. I haven't done this, but have you ever accidentally pooed yourself? Oh, well, look at that there. Well, well yeah. yeah. yeah mm, me yeah. too. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to be honest. I don't even think mine was an accident. Really. <laughs> <laughs> I, I knew it was happening. I knew it was happening. Gee, that's got to be a different feeling. Because I've had a I've had a mistakenly happen twice. Mistaken. Well documented on this show. Mm. Yeah, Jackie too. She had to stop the car and just logged it out in the street one day. <laughs> I ain't mad you know at Jackie. I, I'll be a hundred percent honest with you. Um, this was on my last tour, the Irresponsible tour. We were in where was I at Quine? We were in. Stop! Uh, when I when I shit on myself, what's it? Was that? Oh 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 oh, Oslo. Oslo. So we're in Oslo. Wow, what a place and, to do it! And I'm, my stomach like is messed up bad because mm. I ate some bad uh, bad chicken at the time. Mm. And Chief I'm on you stage. Went there, mm -mm, you I had nothing to do with yeah, that. No, 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 Never been to Oslo. Stage, didn't even know that exists. I sit on to it for like 45 minutes before I go on stage, and I'm praying to God, like just let this be out. I can't cancel the show, but I'm sick. Like literally, right. I'm throwing up. It's coming out of both ways all day mm. i'm on stage i'm 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 haul assing through the show i'm going you know 80 miles per hour through the show yeah. i get to the last nine minutes of my set <laughs> hand on a bible as i say a joke the crowd laughs my stomach my stomach said i'm, I'm ready to get out of here <sighs> and i said uh oh well i'm not and you knew it the crowd's not, cheering the crowd you, is going you can't off. even accept the greatness the crowd is going crazy you're I go ready to, i go to tell another joke and i said okay uh, this is going to happen it's going to happen <laughs> like it's no, there's no way for it not to happen it's going to happen yeah, it's said, like I when a damn wall breaks open yeah, said, you, there's no it's going no, back. there's no going i yeah. said the best thing to do is let it happen and just finish the finish the show. So, <laughs> bop, 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 bop. I fired off and your Tommy John fired off. <laughs> uh, I had my jacket on the mic stand. I grabbed the jacket, uh, wrapped it around my waist, so uh, I didn't turn around and get a crowd of visual. Uh, uh, 
<laughs> when I said goodnight, I go to walk off the stage. My security was there. They were like, all right, boss man, what's going on? Where to? I said, the bathroom. Fast, go. <laughs> and I Pick left them drawers and them jeans in that bathroom. Oh. I walked out of there. I walked out of there with just my jacket. That's exactly what I did at but the British Airways terminal in uh, Heathrow. Yeah. Well, you got to dump it. You yeah. can't keep the clothes. No, no, no. I was at work. I was, tw- it was, I was just turned 21. And uh, this one I learned I can't drink dark liquor. I had uh, my 21st birthday, drank a lot of dark liquor. Uh-uh. Next day, went to work, picked up a suitcase. I was working at the ticket counter, picked yeah. up a suitcase, and then uh, everything flew out the back door. Oh, and uh, man, yeah, I wasn't ready. I was. She was not ready. She was not ready. Oh and um, we, everybody could smell it. And oh. it, it <laughs> fell down my leg, and out the bottom of my and in my pen in my socks and onto the floor and um, I had to use a bag tag to scoop up uh, what was there (laughs) throw that in the trash and then I like uh, slowly walked to the back and then I ripped out the lining of my pants and threw my panties away and uh, washed up as best I could in the sink and told them I need to go home they said no we got several sold out flights you're gonna have to wait at least three more hours to get these flights off the ground and so then I was known as a boo-boo girl for at least three months (laughs) at the job they thought I was gonna quit but I wasn't I'm not gonna give up Oh no, I'd God. rather be the boo-boo girl than an unemployed girl. Can we just talk about the, the whole visual of it going down your leg? That's yeah, it went down my me. leg and hit I got to floor. fight you. If I see if I see that <laughs> and I work with you, I got to fight you. Well, There's I, no way. Well, there's no way. I was young. I didn't have no power over that area oh at that point. God. I was 21 and I had drank a lot of dark liquor. I don't drink dark liquor to this day. Only vodka. Mm-hmm. Only vodka. Only vodka. And you now learned you're your lesson. I oh. learned my lesson. Big time. Good. Yeah, Look. yeah. That's a cleanser right there. Any dark liquor is a cleanser for me. That's a- <laughs> <laughs> we got to wrap this interview up. You guys have got a big day ahead and a big premiere tonight. Secret Life of Pets 2. Oh. In cinemas for everyone to go and enjoy June 20. You I guys have it. been so much fun. Thanks for coming in. Oh, thank thank you. you. Love you guys. Wow. Thank you. That's some incredible I, stuff. I love coming here. I'll be back um, in January. Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah, I'm going to come back. Tour or what just, are you doing? Do, no, no, I'm just making a movie out here. So any available bachelors that don't have any kids <laughs> that's interested <laughs> in me, that you feel like you could pick up 76 kilos and burp it, uh, <laughs> hit me up on Twitter or Instagram. <laughs> uh, let me look at some pictures of you, see how strong you are, and what's up with your front tooth situation. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> always love coming here, man. You guys are always a pleasure. Oh, and love you, Shout Kevin. out to all straight. Seriously, you guys. Yeah. We love you. Here. Welcome me with open arms, uh, and you know to be here with Tiff this time around and have an amazing product to talk about, man. It just makes it even more exciting. It's thrilling. Yeah. Open arms for you, open legs for Tiff. <laughs> 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 hey, they not open yet, but they trying to get there. Hello. <laughs> Enjoy your time here. Thanks, guys. Nice to see you.